Here, I'll show you. So, obviously your distributor's down here. It, your distributor actually also drives the fuel pump on a Chevette. Uh, I had another engine over here I'll show you some other things on. But uh, So you have your crank. Your crank stops here. And your pulley is actually what spaces everything out for a belt. Um, there's a gear on the crank that drives your distributor. On the bottom of the distributor is a cammed eccentric that drives a push rod that drives your fuel pump. So it keeps everything real tight and compact. It's a bitch to work on in the car because um, the intake comes out over top of it. But uh, then you just have a, a timing belt. And then there's a tensioner. There's a little, there's a round tensioner that goes here and pushes over on it, keeps it tight. And then there's your camshaft. And all that does, it has high pressure oil ports that feed each lobe. So it's got a really kick ass oiling system in it. Uh, and then it just does valve actuation. And this is the exhaust side spark plugs and exhaust runners. That's it. You see on this one, down there is the oil pump drive coming off. So it also, the distributor drives the oil pump just like it does on most GMs. The oil pump sits down here in this sump in the front of the pan. And then there's a hole right through there for the fuel pump push rod. Not much to it really.